I am drawing a ketchup bottle in watercolour and fine liner inspired by the work of Georgina Look. So I'm starting by a really light outline, uh, looking at a picture of the ketchup bottle uh, for my drawing here. Here I've noticed my drawing is not symmetrical, it's much thinner on one side than the other. So I've drawn a symmetry light and just kind of using a ruler to make sure that it's kind of symmetrical on there uh, and I've got the proportions balanced correctly. So once I've done this and got the label in place, I'm just going to go and put the lettering for the branding on there. Here the lettering is fairly simple, I'm just trying uh, my best to copy uh, the font that is used and the style of the letters on here. Uh, some of the writing is too small for me to see so I just put some indication here uh, of some marks really. Uh, here just getting the graphic of a tomato branch on here, uh, just getting the outline for this and uh, the top label as well. I'm trying to include all the small detail which is what's going to make my drawing interesting. Once I've got this I'm going to paint it in watercolour so here we need to work really quickly uh, with quite a lot of water so we can blend the colours together while the painting is wet. So I'm doing a flu splashes, uh, adding um, the darks uh, where we've got shading on uh, and just placing the different colours on there. Uh, so I'm just going to colour in the lettering really quickly with the tip of my brush so I'm working uh, quickly so we get that expressive style that Georgia looks got on there. And uh, just adding the detail on the labels here, uh, the kind of brown golden outline and the green outline inside the label as well. Uh, just refining, uh, adding the kind of last couple of bits of detail on there. Uh, some of the writings in red, just doing that in red. So now I've dried my drawing and just coming back over the top and doing the detail in a fine liner here. Um, so I'm just going sim really quickly to get that loose expressive line over my pencil line to just give my drawing back a little bit of definition on there. Uh, give my lettering a little bit more definition as well. And this is really a nice low style, uh, a nice style to use to draw a range of things, not just still life objects.